Today I will cover some tips and tricks and set you on a creative challenge. Introducing Quick Shapes, a meaningful shortcut. Let's make a couple changes to yesterday's drawing. Open the layer panel and find the layer we want to draw on. Add a new layer above. With a long hold, you can turn that messy circle into perfection. Don't lift your Apple Pencil. Hold, tap again, and it will go from the oval to a circle. Tap on the color in the upper right, drag it down, and you can fill that shape. Let's add another layer, and we'll bring it underneath this one. Change our color. Let's draw a shadow underneath this ball. Oval, hold, tap the top to say edit. And now you can move that shape around. You can adjust it until you get it exactly where you want. The thing is, when you stop, it'll then be locked in place. Again, I'm gonna fill this. This will also work with squares, rectangles, or just a line. Let's take a quick look at how to transform things once they're in place. Find your layer group, tap the arrow at the upper right. This will open transformation. Our objects are selected and now we can move them around. They'll work together. We can also scale them bigger or smaller. Now we will duplicate the top layer. It's sitting right on top of the ball, so you don't really see it. Again, hit transform. Now you'll be able to move it around and scale it. Let's reposition it. And let's do that one more time. Now you see how shapes and drawings can multiply just by duplicating layers. Now we put everything we learned this week together in the weekend challenge. You will make music visual. Pick a favorite song. Maybe some music made by educators. Consider how the elements of art can describe sound. Line, shapes, textures, colors. What goes with the sounds that you're hearing? Here's my setup. Let's watch it build. I'm using the song, No Words by Ian Hughes. Thanks for the inspiration. And here's a shot of my final layer panel. Can't wait to see what you create.